Adding your customers to QuickBooks makes it easier for you to invoice them and see who owes you money. Let's go over how to add your customers and their info to QuickBooks, either individually or in bulk, and what you can see on the customers list. We'll also show you how to add some customers and keep them up to date via the QuickBooks Business Network. First, select Customers and Leads, and then Customers to see the customers list. From here, select New Customer and complete the contact information fields. The only required field here is Customer Display Name. The display name is a unique name you give to the customer to track their open balance and other info, and it'll appear on items such as sales forms. You can add notes and attachments, payment details, preferred language, and sales form delivery options. You can also set custom terms to specify within how many days they have to pay your invoices. If you leave this box empty, they will get your default payment terms but you can always change this when you create an invoice. Additional info allows you to enter customer type and business number under taxes. If your customer is a company or business, you may be able to add them through the QuickBooks Business Network. By using the Business Network, the contact info you have for them will stay up to date when they make changes in their QuickBooks account. Type their name into the company name field. As you type, you may see your customer's name pop up. This means they are part of the QuickBooks business network. Select them from the list and choose Save and Send to send them an invitation to connect. Their contact information will remain masked to protect their privacy until they accept your request. Then you'll be able to view their business email, phone number, and mailing address. If they make any changes to these, it will automatically mirror the updates they make in your QuickBooks. You can make edits to the automatically imported fields, but once an edit is made, the field will no longer be updated when your customer makes changes in their QuickBooks account. If you don't see your customer in the network or just want to add them manually, just fill in the fields yourself. When you are done, select Save. If you need to add several customers at once, you can import customers and their info in bulk from a spreadsheet. Go to the New Customer dropdown and choose Import Customers. Attach the spreadsheet and select Next. Then map the fields in your spreadsheet with the fields in QuickBooks and select Next again. Once everything looks good, select Import and you're done. You can see the customers you added in the customer list. By selecting Settings, you can change what information and columns you see here. You can filter customers by forms and payments. Select a customer to see all of the transactions you've had with them, or select Edit to update their information. Whenever you create a new transaction, like an invoice, select your customer, and QuickBooks will automatically populate their details for you. When you create an invoice and send it to your customer, they'll receive an email notification. Customers added through the business network will receive the usual email, along with a notification right in QuickBooks saying they have a pending bill that is ready for review. Start adding customers to your QuickBooks and make it easy to get paid and see who owes you money.